my my view on it is at the Grok 4 live stream last night, Elon actually said something along these lines, which I agree with, which is reality is the ultimate eval engine. Like that's as simple as that. You're not, you're not breaking laws of physics. That's what we all operate in. If I could have any benchmark possible, I would want a perfect simulator of reality. And of course, who wouldn't, but like a perfect simulator of reality. And then that's when you go and that's where you go and simulate on. That's your environment that you can just manufacture different tests for that. In lieu of that, we have approximations that happen um, every now and then. So the way I think about it is if you had like a linear um, spectrum, RKGI one and two, it's a static list of like three or four JSON grids. Static, doesn't move. RKGI three, I guess on the other side would be reality, like pure representation of reality. RKGI three is a step more towards reality, but it's still gonna be a scoped environment. So without knowing what the exact answer is, I do know that RKGI 4 or 5 or whatever it may be will need to allow us to have more axes of freedom that um, are above a 2D 64 by 64 type of grid that comes there. But one thing I do want to I do want to emphasize here is one of the things that sets us apart from other benchmark creators is we don't aim for PhD plus plus problems, like the hardest possible thing that nobody understands. Our anchor and our constraint, which is actually really freeing, is can humans do this, right? Because our hypothesis and our definition of AGI is as long as we can come up with problems that humans can do and AI cannot, then we do not have AGI. And then the flip side of that is also true, which is when us as ArcPrize, we're like, we consider ourselves like our job is to come up with problems that humans can do and AI cannot. When we can no longer do that, for all intents and purposes, that's practically AGI. And the fact that ARC 2 is still out there and humans can do them, and the fact that ARC 3 is going to be out there and humans can do them, proves that we do not yet have AGI. So the other thing I do know about ARC 4, and this is where I'll wrap it up, is that ARC 4 will still be doable for humans, but it's still going to be hard for AI. 